Do you want to know about a famous American named Abigail Adams? She was was born on November 11, 1744, in Maymac, Massachusetts. She was one of the first ladies to live in the White House. I think you will like Abigail Adams. When Abigail was a little girl, she loved to read, but she was she never went to school. But she was lucky. Her mother, Elizabeth Quincy Smith, taught her reading, writing, and arithmetic. But she was very lucky because her father, William Smith, owned a bookstore. But when her father, when her mother taught, taught her, she didn't just teach her. She taught her sister and her brother. Their names are William, her brother, Elizabeth, her sister, and her other sister named Mary. It was an easy childhood. When Abdul was in adult, she married John Quincy Adams. They moved to Grangeview, Massachusetts. But when but John was almost never home because he was at war for a very long time. When John was at war, Abdul had a son named Charles and another son named Thomas and a daughter named Elizabeth. When Charles was born, John got home from the war. When Abigail died, she was 73 years old. She died on October 28, 1880 in Peaceville. When John went at war, she had a she had she didn't she didn't she just watched kids. She had no dog. When Abdul died, Abdul died from cancer. Abdul was famous because she was one of the first ladies in the White House. She also was an amateur and she also wanted more opportunity for education for women. In fact, she put her black hair in her book. I told that because I thought it would be fun to research a person that lived a long time ago. I found out it was fun. I also found out lots of things about her. She is very inspiring. Very good. You got the work.